Microsoft went from a leading giant in the browser wars of the 2000s to an also ran, but the company's latest version of Edge is shockingly good. Using the same rendering engine as Google Chrome, Edge runs faster and uses less battery than a usual browser. If you're using Edge, but you aren't sure how to block websites, you're in luck. There's an easy to use extension you can grab. Here's how it's done. To start, just open the link in the description below in the browser to get to the extensions page for Edge, then click on Git to install it. The browser will throw up a warning regarding what the extension can do. To proceed, just click on Add Extension, and the extension will start installing itself. Once it installs, you'll be shown a page of frequently asked questions should you want to learn more. To configure the extension's settings, right-click the enclosed W icon near the address bar and select Extension Options. From here, you'll be able to set how the extension works. Feel free to browse and look through these settings. The most important thing to set, though, is the master password. To set this, just scroll down to the Tools section, type one in on the labeled box, and click on Save to the left. Now, you're set to start. To block a site using the extension, just head to the site you want to block, then click again on the enclosed W icon. You'll be asked to enter a password you've set to continue. Enter it, and the pop-up will notify you that the website you've chosen and any URL bearing the keywords typed below will be restricted. Click OK to proceed. The site will immediately redirect to a restricted access page. To unlock the page for a short while, just enter your password below and tap the Enter key. By default, the extension unblocks the site for a minute. You can set a custom length in the Options page under Blocking Options. You can relock the site before that by restarting your browser. If you want to remove blocking entirely, enter your password, then click on Remove Blocking. If you like this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Edge and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.